name is Onyo Jedidaki, bro. Um, I played the role of uh, Paul in, in this series called Share Life. My name is Mocha Chine Evelyn. My name is Mona Stevenson in the movie known as GD. Hi, I'm Crystal and I'm playing the role of a weird nerdy girl in this movie called Share Life. My name is Nelson Ewu and on the set of Share Life. I play the character of Ife Gazier. My name is Dr. Chukukesh Tatsalibik and I am on the set of Share Life. My character name is Kalima. My character in this movie is Kamsi. Kamsi is um, a rich, spoiled bro <laughs> Okay, um, a rich, spoiled kid that does whatever she likes. Paul is a very chill person. Uh, He's brilliant, but you know, some real life issues. He he comes from a very, very humble background, so he tries to combine the real life issues he has and um, academics. Well, I think Haima is, she's part of those girls in school who are trying to live up to the standard there while she does not even have that in the house. She does, yeah. I think this is quite an interesting character, yeah, interesting character. Although the first time I was reading the script, I was trying to find his characterization. Like, you know, he appeared to be this kind of person, an overthinker. What psychology is called overthinker. He thinks a lot. One minute he's here, the next minute he's off. It's a very school movie, but it's more than that. And like, I've really learned a lot, and it's motivating. And I'm playing as. I'm DB and I'm very happy. I'm so happy to be here. I'm really grateful and I pray it works out as we planned. Thank you. Talking about my experience so far in this movie, I think um, it's good. I've learned so many things. Though I'm in theater arts, but then there are things we don't practicalize in school that I've learned here. This is actually my first professional acting, so I want to thank. Uh, the producers and the director and everybody for giving me this wonderful opportunity and um, for me it's an experience because it's been nice so watch out for share life thank you very much and my experience so far well the directing the acting has been crazy uh, everyone has been tired too. I've met some few cool people here. Mm, I don't know their names though, to be it, but they're cool. So, uh, the director is, um, he gives us that ginger like, hey, I don't have time, you have to work with my time. Nice director, like, there's nothing as a nice director. Director Ken. <laughs> This is not the first time I've worked with him. I've worked with him, with him before. And uh, I must say, the first time I worked with him, I said to myself, oh my god, this guy is so fastidious. Like, it's very difficult to please. So that's, that's the job. But, fortunately, I must confess that I am very wrong. The guy is doomed. The guy is a professional to the core. Like, he's not a mediocre. He doesn't take nonsense. If you are not getting it, Ken is not going to take it. He won't take it. And that is what makes me professional. So I'm so happy to work with professionals. Because when the job comes out, oh man, you need not to be told what it will be, what results it will bring. So the guys, do. the crew members, they are all wonderful. They are professionals to the core. They do their jobs as at one do. They are not ordered about. They don't need you to remind them of all their stops. Like they, have, they came with their A game, like stops of crew members. Then the PM, looking at him, you won't know that he's a very serious somebody. But when he gets to work, like, it's very serious and personal. Thank you, thank you. Oh, the props, oh, the props guy is wonderful. Like, that guy is too good. Oh, Jesus. What's his name, Jonas? Jonas is wonderful. I recommend Jonas to anybody that is tested and trusted. Yeah. Small productions, thank you guys for choosing me and thank you for bringing me here. Thank you. Um, well, there, there's, there's more to explore, so I can't see much right now.